It was about three years ago, Ms. Faircloth had emailed me, um, had I heard of, was Project Unified then, because she had received an email from a Cary High School student, and I said, yes, I have. And so I primarily thought it was just the middle school and high schools, but wanted to start that here at the elementary school level, so um, did what we needed to do and started it. We have uh, fourth and fifth grade representatives from each um, grade or each track, and so that's uh, gosh, about 40 representatives, um, two in each class. We learn about people with and without intellectual and developmental disabilities um, and we, how we can learn and play and live unified together, um, not only at the school but uh, as they get older and learn to accept people not just because of the way they might look or act um, but just create a kind and inclusive environment. We've been just getting, trying to get these on our faces. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> We've been having battles with the, all of our trusty whips, right? Yeah, sure. And you're green, and I'm red. Show them what you've been doing. I've been doing this for two years. I wanted to join this club because I've heard people have been, been being rude to other kids because of how they are and I don't think that's right that they get treated that way yeah. because they're the kindest people on earth like Connor and funniest and I don't like when people are mean to other kids. Every time I come in here I always make a new friend and I always learn that um, that our friendship will never die. Yeah.